my dear boys and girls welcome back again to your favorite astrology channel which is jupy man astrology so today in this video we are gonna talk about so what will gonna happen when your seventh lord is placed in the nakshatra of dhanista as per that what are the like characteristics like the kind of a spouse you can expect okay so in this video we're gonna talk about that now guys i would like to tell you before you move forward you can directly take consultation from us we have created a website now it's so simple you can go there link in the description and the comment section below you can just click there and just in just click of a button you can just simply purchase directly consultation from us as the instruction are given the website and then we will just help you out in the consultation okay guys so for that links are in comment section and description you can purchase consultation also if you are a male you can watch this video for your wife if you are a female you can watch this video for your husband so what will gonna happen when your seventh lord is placed in the nakshatra of dhanista so first of all i would like to tell you that nakshatra of dhanista is ruled by the planet mars okay it is ruled by the planet mars so it show that your spouse will be a very active person okay in life they are physically very active um also very energetic person full of energy can be seen okay um your husband or wife or i can say your spouse will be a very active and energetic person can be seen by dhanista nakshatra uh as your seventh lord is placed in the dhanista nakshatra it also show uh that your spouse will be a very courageous person they will have a tremendous courage because of mars right also it showed that your spouse will be very strong like you know strong will powered person they will have a strong will power if they would like to achieve something they have that will power that okay i don't care what the hell will happen but i will achieve it okay are you getting my point uh they will have good wealth and resource you going to have to understand that in terms of wealth they are good you may get someone who is like a rich spouse definitely there are high chances of that or because when your seventh lord is placed in this nakshatra of dhanista okay uh, your spouse will have materialistic happiness it can also be seen your spouse may love music related things right maybe playing musical instrument they love it maybe listening music or maybe singing uh, you know music related things your spouse can be interested in these kind of thing that can also be seen when your seventh lord is placed in the nakshatra of dhanista also your spouse like some uh, playing some musical instrument as i already told you now your spouse can be in can be good in sports it's also possible right that they your spouse may love playing some sport or maybe good in sport or maybe in some sports like a sportsman can also be seen your spouse um because of this nakshatra dhanista influence also it may possible that your spouse brother play an important role in their life like uh brother role is quite important uh, in your spouse life can be a trustworthy person when your seventh lord is placed in the nakshatra of dhanista it show that spouse can be a trust trustworthy and honest person okay very honest person can be expected also your spouse will be intelligent and a very joyful by nature okay little bit of funny and like joy having in their life that can also be seen uh also i would like to tell you that uh, uh intelligent spouse with a smiling face can be expected because of this dhanista nakshatra influence and also it show that your spouse can have business capabilities they can be good in business also although sometime it is also seen that your spouse can be a bit sensitive sometime also because of this nakshatra influence but a very pure hearted person can be expected okay and little bit workaholic person can also be expected like they oh, like my god they are just crazy about work very workaholic person um but the good thing is that they are very committed person your spouse will be a very committed person that's really fantastic your spouse can be in some high authoritative position that can also be possible okay your spouse can be a part of some large organization okay it may also possible your spouse can have charitable nature like they likes to do a lot of charity they likes to help poor people needy people it may also possible that's really one of the best qualities that you have because charities are really good for your life your spouse can be uh, in some music related field that can also be possible your spouse will be little bit angry in nature because obviously mars energy is there so it is like an expected thing that sometime they can be aggressive also or like angry also right um your spouse will look happy from outside but from inside 
there is some kind of void in them okay like as if like there is some little bit of void that you have to fill okay your spouse may have um expectations from you now what it is you will get it once you get married <laughs> so uh your uh, just you simply your uh, uh, you know intelligence in your relationship it's quite important for you it's a kind of advice that i can give you uh, now i think next thing what i would like to tell you that your spouse will be a lucky like spouse will be a lucky charm for you you are quite lucky once you get married to the person your spouse is like a lucky charm for you overall dhanishta nakshatra when your seventh lord is placing the dhanishta nakshatra it show that spouse will be nice and a beautiful person okay and if in case you are watching for a husband then he will be a handsome person spouse will be goal oriented and a very ambitious human being okay and spouse will have some kind of a magnetic look and a very good body structure can be expected because of this nakshatra influence your spouse will have a younger face that can also be possible and your spouse will have a love for fashion like very fashion savvy fashion loving kind of a spouse can be expected because of this nakshatra influence okay also i would like to tell you that uh, your spouse will have a very nice smile okay and a very charming look uh, also your spouse may love luxurious thing like luxury etc is important for your spouse uh, your spouse will have positive vibrations overall and a very adventurous person can also be like they may love adventure sports and like you know all these kind of uh, Uh, adventure sport lover kind of a person can also be expected spouse may love traveling they may love to travel spouse do not like uh, other people to interfere in their life okay um, they 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 do not ex expect like or i can say that they hate that when if someone else just interfere in their personal life they do not like that and that's really a good thing A spouse will be adjustable by nature that's really a good thing for you again a spouse will have a real and heroic nature uh um, spouse can be optimistic wealthy philosophical person that can also be expected in terms of profession can be musician poet doctor surgeon real estate property business scientist research related work engineer or maybe sportsman all these kind of fields can be expected when your seventh lord is placed in this nakshatra of dhanishta so it's all about seventh lord in nakshatra it takes me a long time to just uh, wrap up the data and just tell you some important thing about all the nakshatra i just try to tell some uh, you know things that are related to nakshatra um although obviously full horoscope consultation is required to see the big picture because then you say where your seventh lord is placed in which sign which you know in which sign in navamsha etc and a lot of things so for that full horoscope consultation is required you can do that by clicking the link in the description and i will catch you in the next video my dear boys and girls bye bye